So here is what's happening. I've been working tirelessly. I'm gonna be a number one Amazon best-selling author. Who are you? Publish your Kindle ebook. It's been like 36 hours since I even started writing my book. Big news. <laughs> I can't believe it. I didn't know it was gonna be this easy. I am a number one Amazon best-selling author. You're probably reading the title and being like, Okay. So here is what's happening. Yes, I'm writing a book, but it's not like every YouTuber who's like, oh my god, I'm writing a book, like, Bleh. and it's not like a real author would who's like, <laughs> yeah, I'm writing a book, like, drops a book, you know what I mean? So basically there's this guy, Austin, who I follow on Twitter. I see Austin's Twitter on my feed one day, and he has a bunch of tweets about like, how he released a book about maritime law. And I was like, what? He chose a really specific category. Like, he did nonfiction, law, maritime law. Like, there's, like, a bunch of categories on Amazon that you've never heard of. Because, like, one, not very many people are writing these books. Number two, not very many people are buying these books. I ended up selling his book for 99 cents. So he got a number one Amazon book, which I think is, one, freaking like, what the heck? Number two, I want to put that on my resume because if I was applying for jobs, which I probably will have to do, they would probably be like, you're a number one Amazon author and either leave it at that and be like, holy cannoli. Or number two, they'd ask me about it and be like, what is that about? And then I'd explain it and they'd be like, oh my god, this guy's hilarious. And so I asked Austin if I could steal his idea and he said yes. And I'm going to have his book and his Twitter in the description, so please go buy his book if you're interested in maritime law. So then I was like, all right, I'm ready to do the same thing, but I want to make it Fun. So basically there's this website that I found called Niche Pursuits and it's basically about self-publishing an Amazon book. So basically, long story short, there's a bunch of categories on the Amazon bookstore and they're all ranked. So for instance, this book that you see here is under the category Kindle ebooks, nonfiction, science, rivers. And it's the number one best-selling river book. <laughs> and its bestseller rank is number 27,888. And as they explained here, a book with an Amazon bestselling rank of 10,000 is likely to sell less than 10 copies a day. So this book on rivers is probably selling maybe a few copies a day. Maybe. You know, like probably less than that. Because who's buying this river book for $12? No one is the fact. That's great for me. <laughs> so I went and did a little snooping on Amazon Kindle bookstore. So science and math is a category that's like apparently really easy to get a bestseller based on my research. And then I went to experiments, instruments, and measurements because like who's doing that? And then weights and measures because weights and measures like that's something we all know. It's like inches into feet, ounces into pounds, yeet into yeah. You know what I mean? So here's the bestseller. So when I click on here, oops, sorry. Oh my god, Scott Loki bad though. So yeah, if I go to this book, which is the number one bestseller, it is number 33,046. And it is a bestseller in two categories and number two in one category. Meaning it probably sells one to two copies a day. That sounds like something I could be, you know? So I'm gonna do it. <laughs> A Stan Twitter's guide to weights and measures. I'm not gonna write all of them on camera because when you buy my book, I want you to be surprised somewhat. <gasps> so here's an example of what the questions will look like. In the song, they say the word do 27 times. Each do counts as one ounce. How many pounds of do do we have? So I'll check in when I'm submitting it and what that process is like. Anyway, Stan Luna. A few inches later. Hi. I've been working tirelessly all day on my book and it is done. <laughs> it's like 10 pages. It has a cover, a bunch of illustrations, and it has a bunch of words. <laughs> and now I'm going to show you uploading it and hopefully it gets accepted. My author debut, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Want to learn about weights and measures in a fun and relatable way? This is <laughs> Stan Twitter, where you at? Categories, okay. Science, weights and measures, and then I'm gonna do math, recreations and games. Upload my ebook manuscript. Shut up. Uh oh, PDF files do not produce great results. Okay, okay, okay. I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out a little bit. It's not right. Okay, I need to figure this out. 
So, you know, I know I look kind of like ass right now, but I've been diligently working and working hard. And you know, sometimes the life of a successful author, sometimes it's not pretty. Clearly. I took like a day and figured out how to properly format. It's really annoying. I downloaded like several programs. It took a long time. Next step, pricing. This is like way more hard than I thought. Like publishing a book, you'd think that it'd be so easy. And I bet like some people who are actually like into writing are like cringing so hard. But get over it, sis. I'm going to be a number one Amazon bestselling author. Who are you? Hopefully. I hope we get there. I'm getting cocky a little bit. I am. <laughs> Please buy it. I'll Venmo you 99 cents. I'm only going to be making like 30 cents per book. I'm gonna be rich. <laughs> 99 cents. 99 dollars. No, 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 no. Publish your Kindle ebook. I'm nervous. <laughs> what if they reject it? I'm like really afraid they're not gonna accept this. I'm afraid they will be like, there is not enough words on here. But it's kind of, it's a picture book. Although it is in the science section. We'll see. <laughs> One wiener later. Hey. <laughs> hey. It's been like 36 hours since I even started writing my book. Big news. It <laughs> happened. I am a published author. I'm actually really excited. I think this is just so funny. <laughs> I don't know how to say it, <laughs> so I'm just gonna say it. It is 8.30 in the morning, the next morning, and I am a number one Amazon best-selling author. <laughs> it's horrible that I was able to do this. Let me get you up to speed. Okay, I didn't know it was gonna be this easy. So basically what I did last night was I tweeted out asking some of you guys if you'd be willing to pay 99 cents to buy this book, and I secretly DM'd you it. And yeah! <laughs> I have sold 29 copies of this 99 cent book. I have made $8.75. I've actually made a little more than that because I got 98 cents from Australia and 29 cents from the UK. $10! What a scam. The first thing you see when you click on it is that I am number one new release in the scientific measurement category. The Amazon best-selling rank as number 13,526. And not only that, but I am number one in three categories. Bestseller in math, recreation, and games, number one. Bestseller in science, weights, and measures, number one. And bestseller in science measurements, number one. Real quick, <laughs> I also just want to mention that I am number 22 overall in the mathematics section, and I'm number five in the science experiments section. I would love to be number one in the math section. I'm already a number one best-selling Amazon author, but <laughs> feel free to buy the book. <laughs> oh, also go review it if you do buy it. So this is pretty huge. I just feel so stupid, but like so smart. We've got a triple number one Amazon best-selling author on our hands, you guys. I'm so, I think this is the funniest thing in the world. I'm gonna put this on my resume three times. Let's read some of the reviews. So Sally Field is a Oscar award-winning actress. Life is a box of chocolates, Forrest. You never know what you're gonna get. And I'm friends with her son. And Sam bought the book and made a review and did it under her account. So I literally have an Oscar award-winning actress also reviewing my book, which is so funny. Jack is the greatest wordsmith since Shakespeare. Changed my life from Samantha. This book gave me a PhD, a masterpiece greater than Starry Night. Thank you. I am a best-selling author of science and math. I'm so bad at math and science. And if some <laughs> STEM nerd comes up to me and they're like, oh, like, I'm studying engineering, blah, I'll be like, I am a best-selling author in the math and science department. So, and it looks like this chapter is ending. If you are interested in buying the book and keeping it on number one for as long as it possibly can, I will have all of the links to the different countries, Kindle stores to buy it. America, England, Britain, Mexico. Did I say England, Britain? <laughs> <laughs> whatever, I'm a number one best-selling author, like, whatever I say, if you try and clap back now, I'm just gonna be like, um, are you a best-selling author? 
Yeah, I don't even know how to end this. This was like so stupid. <laughs> that worked really easily. Like really easily. Like way too easily. Subscribe to PewDiePie and that's about it. My mom's calling me. Hello? Can I buy this book? I can send you a PDF for free. Oh, but I want to buy it.